Hello. Happy Saturday. Oh, I'm so glad it's the weekend. I so I'm so excited to be here with you all. I I just need to chill, have a little relaxation time, decompress and de-stress, all of that fun stuff. Um, oh my goodness, thank you for subscribing again, Oberon. I very much appreciate it. How are you today? Are you having a good weekend? I sincerely hope so. Um, my room is so much brighter. I don't know if you all can notice, but it's like messing with, like, I kind of have a headache from it. So it's always something, I swear. So the other day, you'll see I have a lamp behind my head. Because the other day I'm working and one by one, the lights blow out of my, I have a ceiling fan with lights in it, you know? So one by one, they start going out and I'm like, all right, I'm down to one. So I have my husband come in and I have him change them. Well, he goes to pull out the one that was still working and we hear a big pop. And then new light bulbs and nothing would work. So we had our electrician guy come out and he said, we're just going to put a whole new fan in. And I swear, this thing is like three or four times brighter than my other light. And it's seriously like bothering me. And I'm hoping I just have to get used to it. But I might have to take some of the bulbs out. Like we might have to go like from, what is it? Three, three down to like one or something. Like I feel it right here after I'm in here for a little bit. I don't know. It's crazy. A apparently my other one was not very bright. Um, or the bulbs that were in it weren't very bright. So that was my adventure for the last couple of days. <laughs> Having an, put in a whole new ceiling fan in my office. Because I was working like pretty much in the dark. I brought this little lamp in that's behind me. And that thing didn't do anything. So for a couple of days I was working pretty much in the dark. Um, you all might hear some silly dog noises today. Tonka's the only one being pretty good about it. But my husband's out back doing some yard work. And you can only have a couple of the dogs out there at a time because um, it's muddy right now and we don't want them like running. So Nova is just standing there staring out and kind of like, I can't, I can't even say whining. I don't know. It's like little baby noises. She's make. you can probably hear it. I don't, I can hear it. <laughs> I'm glad you had a good weekend or you will have a good weekend. Sims and Skyrim. Oh, yes. I actually have not been gaming much this week. It's been kind of crazy. Um, still don't have any answers about my horse. Hopefully. So for our upcoming stream that we normally have on Wednesday, I don't think I'm going to be able to have one during the week because I have to swap my day off so that my horse can see the vet on Tuesday. So I'm actually going to be working on Wednesday. Um, but hopefully we will. Okay, you guys can't do this. Hopefully we will be able to get some answers on Tuesday. Fingers crossed. So my horse is on stall rest, obviously. We talked about this before. If you missed it, my horse had an injury a couple years ago. I think she re-injured it now. We're not sure yet. but So she's been stuck in her stall. I decided this morning I was going to take her for a nice walk. The sun was actually out. It's not too cold out. I'm like, all right, we'll go for a little bit of a walk. But she's been cooped up. Oh, my goodness. So for part of our walk, we... For part of our walk, we had to be on the road and a truck came. A truck came and she decided she was going to walk sideways down the street. Um, and he couldn't pass us because she would not stop and just walk straight so he could get by. She was full of it. She was dancing around. So... Not only do I feel bad when my horse is on stall rest, but like mentally, it's not good on a horse to be stuck in a stall 24 seven. So I thought I'm gonna have to close the door. I thought maybe a walk would be helpful, but yeah, that that's not happening. Okay. Hold on one second, y'all. All right, so no doggo cam for the moment. I kicked them all out and I have dub double door 
locked them in the other section of the house. <laughs> so there's two doors in between us. So hopefully you won't hear them. They get so upset when some of them are out and some of them are in. Yeah. Yeah, I wish they could talk. That would be very helpful, wouldn't it? If they could just say, hey, this is what's hurting. Yada, yada, yada. Uh, I don't know. Um, and I say hopefully we have answers on Tuesday because chances are we're going to have to have an MRI before we actually know anything. So we'll see. Multiple vet visits now. And that's to be expected. So what are we doing today in The Sims to de-stress and calm down? We're going to hang out at our new Speak Easy that we built during the last stream. So it was kind of towards the end of the last stream, like on a whim. I don't know. We were talking about like, what were we? I think we were talking about the Great Depression and then it kind of came around to like Mildred not really having anything that she's into or wanting to really do. So, I don't know. Somehow, we just looped around to we're going to build a little dungeon under the barn that is a secret place for them to have their friends come over and drink illegal alcohol during Prohibition. So, it's essentially a speakeasy. And we put a little, like, I downloaded a CC microphone, um, but unfortunately, she's still going to hold the wireless one just because of the way that that works um even though i downloaded an old-fashioned microphone she's still gonna have that in her hand but i got that in we're going to take the evening time and you know just let the sims kind of hang out and we don't have a whole lot of time for it but let's see <clears throat> so our calendar um i guess I guess we kind of do. So the new decade when the Great Depression is coming is basically a sim week away. Um, in like a day. Because this is the, the new decade eve. And then we have the new decade here on Saturday. So we have a little bit over a week in game for them to enjoy this speakeasy. Um, I, I haven't really thought about... Like, theoretically, they should make some money off of this. Oh my goodness, you can make moonshine with base mental? Ooh. That is... what they would call a pro tip, I think. Thank you, Leaf Simming. We might have to do that. I do not have base mental in. Um, but... I was thinking if we were doing Nectar, that would have been cool, but we're not currently doing Nectar. And I had mentioned doing maybe Mead, like they could make their own Mead with the, there's like a mod for um, like brewing Mead. But I just opted for assuming they are going through like the underground channels to obtain the alcohol from like bootleggers we can assume because we weren't already making nectar and I'm not going to go through the process of like having them start that now. We're not going to be able to enjoy this too, too long in game. What did I come in here for? Oh yes. The ceiling. I want to put some ceiling up. Uh, but I, I just, we're just going to imagine that Ren went through her midlife crisis. What? Went through her midlife crisis and decided that she wanted to ignore the rules. What the heck? <laughs> ignore the rules and yeah, put this in. Thank you so much for subscribing once again, D Sims. You guys are awesome. Yeah, so let's just take a look at our little speakeasy that we built. It's nothing grand, I have to say. Um traditionally like a speakeasy would be kind of obviously hidden but it would also like they had like a very like dimly lit mysterious vibe to them um so we kind of have that going on a little bit but it's also more of a western it's really nothing extravagant what i did want to do though and i forgot to do it before stream i did give everyone their makeovers that i promised i was going to give um i want to grab don't we have the um globe bar yeah i want to put that down there because i have concerns that 
they're not actually going to really use the bar efficiently because obviously they have to mix the drinks. So I'm going to put this here because it's a little bit easier for them to get drinks from. And we might have to just do it that way. Hi, Princess Robotif. How are you? So good to see you here today. I hope you're doing well. We have not really gotten started yet. We're just chit-chatting about our new speakeasy that we built. And what I ended up doing was I made clubs. Now, I did give additional makeovers to Sims in the world that are not in the clubs that I created. And that's just because like nobody in our family really knows these Sims. And I didn't have time to set that all up so that we could actually add them to the clubs. But we essentially have like Leo's younger generation here. Corinna, I had to include her for old times sake. And then who did I give the other one to? I gave it to Ren. And then there's like Ren's generation plus Mildred and Sam. So we're going to see if this actually works. Like if we start a gathering, um, they're supposed to drink bar drinks, watch live entertainment and play cards. So theoretically, they should come down here and do those things. Um, I might have to add. Um, I think there's like a, a make drinks, mix bar drinks. Maybe I'll just add it and see if that helps. I just worry that they're not actually going to use this because someone has to actually make it, you know, and I don't know how that's going to work. But everybody got makeovers. And let me tell you all, these women are slaying the 1920s. I went all out for their formal outfits for more of like the kind of like the flapper look. Um, some of them are a little more modest than others, like Mildred here, pretty modest, but she's got I was going to give her a hat and I forgot, but she's got the pearls, the sparkly sequins, the long coat. She's killing it. Um, I don't remember what I put Ren in, but that's going to be the one thing that's going to suck. We're going to have to try to like change them into the appropriate clothing when they show up, but it's fine because it's not a community lot. Like I can't like do an event. Well, I could do an event. We could do an event at home. And set it to formal. We'll just, we'll try it out. We'll see how it goes. We have some time to play around with it. Do you need new Sims? Um, Oberon, I always need new Sims. I actually was going to talk about that. Um, I want to add new Sims to this playthrough for sure. Not going to get to that today, probably. Um, but I would actually like to see some more, like, various ages, like, Maybe even some more children that we can add to the world. Obviously, they would need to have a family with them. Um, but I do want to add some more Sims because we do have the second generation coming up now. Um, actually, how many days does he have? He has nine days until he's a teen. So we have a couple friendos for him now. Um, but he's related to Arlene. Um, the only girl available in the world for him right now is... I don't know if this is Katharina... Um, I was, I think I was saying Katarina, but Vampire Diaries vibes, maybe she's going to be Katarina to me. Okay. That's all I'm saying. Uh, but so he has friends, but he's going to eventually obviously need a love interest. So yeah, it might be worth, yeah, if you have some, um, I'm also going to be repopula repopulating the ultimate decades challenge world a little bit. Um, I'm almost done. I promise, I promise, I'm almost done with killing off all the Sims who died during the plague, uploading them to the gallery. I'm still uploading, I'm kind of uploading them as I like kill them off. So it's being sporadic right now. I have not unfortunately had time to just sit down and just do it in one fell swoop. I've been so busy. So it's coming in stages, but I'm almost done. And I've been working on the video as I do it as well. So the video should be coming very soon. I promise. I'm so sorry. I know. I'm slow. It's fine. I do my best. So <laughs> that's coming and I we need to repopulate the world um, a little bit. We'll probably do it in stages too. Just slowly add Sims to that world. Um, for one thing, I don't want to use up all the Sims you all have uploaded. Although for the Ultimate Decades Challenge, there are a lot of Sims in there. So... Um, Probably need it more for this one than that. And I do have Not So Berry as well. So if you want to ever create any like modern Sims, 
those are welcome as well for the not so berry challenge all right let's see so she's actually down here like practicing her singing before school um she's not great but she's not horrible either she wants to be the singer of the speakeasy so she's gonna do the performances and i figure what we'll do is we'll go through our days we'll do our thing maybe ren might have her club come over while the kids are at school and then maybe later at night the younger generation will have their club gathering in the speakeasy and hang out and yeah so they're involved the teens are very much involved in this i do not condone underage drinking i'm just saying <laughs> this was a different time okay <laughs> um but everyone's gonna be getting ready to go to school all i i only played through the night i did not play any additional days or anything so it's just morning time and they're all getting oh our child's starving um what are you eating did you make food and not give it to your kid because can you not see your child is starving? Oh, Maybe get some food for your kid. What do we have in here? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Nada. We have this. We'll put this out. Oh my gosh. Why did I do that? Oh, yeah. I have not played Sims much aside from just going in and doing posing taking pictures and using mc command center to kill them off i will give you guys a fun little hint so i have not done the pleading yet for our main family okay i have not tried so that excluding that grim has saved one of our sims from our list so far so you'll have to wait for the video to see who that is that grim saved um the, basically, the last thing I have to do is sort out our main family and Folk and Mary. I have not done them yet. <clears throat> I think I am going to plead for Oscar. Haven't done that yet. I would just hate to see Mary's jeans completely, like, die out. So it's worth a shot there. All right. Kids are going to all go to school. They're probably all very hungry. So can you come grab food before you go to school, maybe? Oh, you must have eaten something. Um, wow. This poor guy. Oh, oh. Yeah. So we're sending our kids to school hungry. I did not. I don't know why I was thinking they still had an hour. Mm, they don't. Are you washing those in dirty water? Because I will cry. Oh, you're, you're not actually going to wash them? Well, <laughs> That is on brand for you, Ren. Stick them in the dirty water and just leave them. So along with the fashion that we're kind of embracing now, we were moving kind of slow with it. I think now we're just going to start moving forward at a quicker pace with stuff. So I want to keep updating the house as well. And I have downloaded some additional... Um, like appliances and stuff that would fit the time period. You're too uncomfortable. Oh my gosh. No, don't cook. There's food right here. I know it's not the best, but. Oh my. Your birthday's coming up, isn't it, kiddo? Yes. Your birthday is on Saturday. Obviously, this generation is moving much slower for us. Um, we kind of popped out babies a lot for the first generation. These guys were pretty much waiting until like the youngest child is a child, like before we're moving on and trying to have another. I don't know how many kids they're going to end up having. I don't feel like it's going to be very many, maybe one more. I don't know what vibes we're feeling. We're to a point now where family planning is going to become more of a thing, right? The, the ladies are going to be thinking more about, mm, do I really want to become pregnant right now? Kind of thing. So strict family dynamic because you want to change her diaper, I'm guessing. How about no? How about no on that one? <sighs> Ren, did you eat? Okay. You're eating on the bed, I see. Oh, 
Oh, it's no mosque. Oh, oh. <laughs> ah, Dorne. Dorne. Ooh, We're apparently sure. still using disposable diapers. Mildred's latest classroom assignment is a group project. Her group mates are all pretty smart. Should she try to contribute as much as they do or just let them do the work? Um, Mildred. I almost feel like she would let them do the work. She lost. Of course. Of course she did. Um, what was I doing? I was going to set you to cloth diapers. Um, am I forgetting anything else? I don't, we haven't had birthdays in a while, so I feel a little bit out of sorts. I'm used to, in this playthrough, like having a birthday every time we do a live stream. And last time we had nothing. We had like nothing to do. Our boredom drove us to build a speakeasy for Pete's sake. <laughs> so I got to get back into the groove of things. Oh, we need to check on our chickens because I got a notification that one of them was getting old earlier. Um, so you're right here. Why don't you handle this? Let's see. We probably have to trade. Elder, young adult, adult, and young adult. That's right. We did buy new, a couple of new chickens and a hen chick last time, I believe. So let's just sell the elder for now. That'll be good. I feel like we have not been hunting in a while, so maybe I'll send him hunting. I mean, that's still something we're going to be doing. He needs to really um, train his horses, though. All right, go hunting, and then you can train your horses. You're still eating. Are you feeling better enough now to get some water and do the laundry? Please, Ren. Um, let her handle the garden. She has the gardening aspiration. She wants to plant stuff. So we're going to have to get her some seeds. I'll send her out to harvest. Um, water. What needs watered? These... I cannot weed and I have to do them myself so they don't die. This is the most annoying bug that just does not end ever. It just never ends. Like since the inception of gardening in The Sims 4, this has been a thing. Which I wouldn't care if it didn't kill the plants. But the plants will die from weeds that I cannot actually weed. Oh, I should have set the horses to train them dang selves while I went hunting, shouldn't I have? That would have been the smart thing to do. Alright. I gave her some new outfits for around the farm, too. Um, what are you doing, kiddo? Oh no, why are you in the speakeasy? Are you listening to... Like club music? <laughs> Honey. Oh my goodness. Um. Replace the water. Okay, now do the laundry. You need to just make your way back here. Run here. Yes, run here. So we can actually take care of you here in a minute. Although everyone's kind of busy getting stung by bees. <laughs> a little bit busy right now getting attacked by bees in the garden. <laughs> she is so pretty though. I can't wait for you all to see their new formal outfits. They're looking so stinking cool. I'm a little bit bummed out because there were several dresses I downloaded that I was so excited for. And I thought I had the meshes. Um, but you know how when you're... Hey, Turlet! I feel like it's been a minute since I've seen you. How are you? You know how when you're downloading... Like, I don't know about you all, but when I'm downloading CC, like, I will open a bunch of tabs of the stuff that I want and then I'll go download it, right? Um, 
so let's say I found like a bunch of stuff on Pinterest and I, I know I want to download it. I'll just open it all and then I'll go one by one and download it. So I thought I had the meshes that I needed. And then when I came into the game and started doing makeovers, I realized I didn't. So I closed the game and I went back out and I tried to hunt down these mess, the messes. Oh my gosh. Meshes. And they were going to a page that no longer exists. So the mesh that I need for several of the dresses that I really liked, not available anymore. Hi, Silk. How are you? Oh, you, you're kind of feeling, not feeling the Sims at the moment. I get that, Turlet. I do. If it weren't for the historical challenges, yeah, it, I, I would have a difficult time. Why does she keep pausing like this? Ren? <laughs> Ren is short circuiting. <laughs> okay, are you bathing your child? Yay, you're so smart. And you're going to pee your pants. All right, you're back from hunting. What did you get for us? You got a squirrel and a wild boar and duck. Okay, I feel like these could all be cut up for meat, probably. It took me so long to realize that you can use these as whole animals for some recipes, too. Like, it's embarrassing that it took me so long to figure that out. Um, low quality meat it must have come from the squirrel, huh? All right, you need to go train your horses. Um, let me guess, their needs are horrible. Hello. Show me the needs. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you're actually, you're good. Um, if you missed it, we did lose our founding horse. Our founding horse died of old age. Rony Pony. We still have Rosie and Rioni, who are like three generations, basically, of Rony Pony genetics. So, yeah. Um, but we are really buckling down and trying to train because he has the aspiration. So we're almost done here. We've almost competed in the 15 that we need, but we have to win gold in five master horse competitions and place at the ultimate horse championship. So that's kind of what we're, we're aiming for right now. I think I'm going to come out here and I'm going to have him direct... Rioni to do the jumps herself and then I'm gonna have him actually ride Rosie on the barrels so his skill goes up and hers but we'll get him do you got ticks now ew don't be bringing ticks home yeah Rony Pony is gone but Rony Pony lived a very long life like 40 years or something like that so <laughs> I I did have my I can't even really say my childhood horse. It was like the best horse I've ever had in my life, but I didn't get her until I was like 13 or 14 and she was already old when I got her, but she lived to be 36 years old. So it does happen, but it is rare that a horse lives that long. So thank you, Turlet. She's not better. She's still on stall rest, but she's been seen by the vet and she's being seen again on Tuesday. Um, so we won't have a Wednesday stream. I was talking about this earlier because I have to swap my day off so that I can be with her with the vet on Tuesday. So I'm going to work on Wednesday instead. Hopefully we'll have more answers then. Um, you know, I made a TikTok and then I never posted it. I made a TikTok that kind of went into detail about all of her issues. Because she's also been battling a skin thing for like years now. And a part of me... He's wondering if that's making her sore, but that's on a back, it's like her back upper leg area, and she seems to be sore in the front. So I don't know, but she's got a whole bunch of stuff going on. Um, she's on stall rest, and she's not having a very good time, but it's all right. We'll get over it. Hopefully everything will be good. I'm trying to hang clothes on the line, Dad. This man calls her like every day. All right. My kids are hating life at the moment. 
she's mad about the group project. I'm sorry, and your performance is awful. So I just screwed you over even worse. Why don't you actually do homework? I don't care if you get a C in school, but we can't be having you drop your grade even lower. That would not be good. Leo. How is he always reading a book and he hasn't gotten this yet? Like, what? He's always got a book in his hand. So that's confusing to me. He is an A student, though. So he can go ahead and do something to let off some steam. Um... Sure, play with JoJo. Did you not listen to me? Why is Rioni over here and not practicing the jumps? Can you explain? Oh. Okay, Rioni knocked him over already. Yeah, all right, perfect. Leave the kid alone. Come on. Come on. Moments peace. You put her to bed? Okay. Yeah, get over here. Come on. Come on. I'm not going to let you die without getting your aspiration, all right? So we need to get on things. Now, I'm not going to get distracted this time. Okay, we're going to set that, and then we're going to find Rosie. Is Rosie also good? Why does it do this? What do I have to do to get it to show me? It only shows me when it wants to show me. Hello, how are the horse's needs? Whatever, <laughs> come get on this horse. <laughs> I've been having an issue with the horses where I have to cheat. Why are you so sad? You look so sad. I've been having to cheat the horse's needs because they won't get fun no matter what. I try to get them to play with the ball and they won't do it. So I'm constantly just having to cheat it. All right, come get on your horse. And if you're just joining, sorry about the empty dog cam. I had to kick them out. Um, because my husband's working in the backyard and they're not happy that they're not out there. So they're like, they're being loud. And you know what's funny, of course, they wait until I actually start the stream to start being loud like that. They weren't doing that before the stream. I wonder what's the difference. Provides a horse with more skill, but will cause the horse to become fatigued more quickly. Hmm. Let's do that. Let's, let's do some intense training. We got, we got goals to meet. You know what I mean? Oh. Uh-huh. Oh my gosh, now he's sick. Or is it just from the, the fleas you brought home? <laughs> just go practice the barrels for Pete's sake, Sam. Oh, he's in no rush either. Look at him moseying over there. Oh, we're already chilling in the speakeasy. It is almost 6 p.m. We, we could start our festivities. What are you up to? She's going into the speakeasy. Are they trying to tell me something? He hasn't even made it over to work the horse yet. You guys, come on. All right, Leo, we're going to party in the speakeasy, but we have things we have to do first. Can you clean? Can you milk? And can you... Oh, yeah, you're going to be here a while doing this. Perfect. And did you do your homeworks? Nice. Can you please come over here? And... Whoops. No. And do this. It's apparently already clean, so you just got to get the eggs. You're getting lucky. Your brother is going to be taking care of that cow for six hours. Dun, 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 dun. We probably need to check the horse stalls, too. They're actually using them sometimes, which is strange. I just uploaded one of my bigger families. It's two adults, one teen, two children, one toddler, and a baby. Woohoo! Sweet, Oberon. Uh-huh. I will have to check Kids. that out. Okay, no, you're not going to cook right now. We got an orange egg. Don't know how, but okay. Two hatchable eggs and a green egg. Well, while you're here, incubate in the coop. And then these are going in the fridge. Incubate those bad boys.
<laughs> you didn't? You didn't name it Kusama? That's a kind of a cool name. Hi, Lion. How are you this fine Saturday? Are you having a good weekend so far? All right. Leo's got to handle all of this. And then everything's pretty much done for... I mean, we're going to need food. Ooh, we really need food. She can't cook for... She doesn't have cooking skill. Um, let's see what we unlocked after hunting. Probably not much of anything. Sure, let's make some fried fowl for everyone. And we can even bring it down into the speakeasy and eat it there. I actually might put this in our inventory so that the club members actually want to go downstairs what just happened i just grabbed a chair so they actually want where am i getting 65 simoleons when i'm putting that whatever um <laughs> so that they actually come down here to play cards instead of playing them there No worries, Oberon. We can like we'll do the makeovers and we'll get them set in the town. I am so the reason why I'm not doing any of that right this second is because I have to fiddle with a new world because we don't have a lot of lots left in this world, if any, at this point. So yeah, we need to make a new world that is just gonna be an extension of this one. Probably Oasis Springs, I'm guessing. Woohoo! Wait, didn't we get level five last time? Okay. Oh my god, if this man calls me one more time. He's he's so obsessed with her. <laughs> Alright, let's start changing into our outfits. I can't wait for y'all to see how wonderful they look. Oh my gosh. Her, I ended up using just an EA dress because I was running out of outfits CC but I think it works um we saw hers at the beginning of the stream she's a little more modest with hers um all right Ren should be close to done cooking that I did not give the guys makeovers um but th they kind of have the general like suit and tie or at least suspenders for their outfits anyway so they'll be fine um i'm gonna let ren finish that <clears throat> right <laughs> look at her with her hair down she's freaking gorgeous it's a little more cleavage like typically like their dresses would have covered more up here but I ran out of outfits, so we had to work with what we had. Charles's spirit is fading away. Oh. Honey, um, I don't know that playing the guitar is really going to work for you. <laughs> it's playing the Sims theme song. I thought I was going crazy for a second. All right, did you finish cooking? All right, let's take that down to the speakeasy. What's wrong? <sighs> Go potty. We're gonna take this to the speakeasy. Nice. All right, you're not that hungry. You are, come eat this. You all can stay here to eat it. Don't you go be going upstairs on me because I'll get annoyed with you wow they're all hungry hungry uh i guess the child is allowed in the speakeasy all right are you ready for your first performance um let's see can i here's the thing i've never tried this and i don't know can you have more than one club gathering at a time i'm worried that because we're gonna way exceed the number of sims on the lot that some of them aren't going to show up. You know what? I might have forgot her makeover. Bumpa, bumpa. 
Okay. Speakeasy one is gathering. Let's see. Okay, it let me start them both. Alright. Now, has anyone ever tried this successfully? So, I actually put... One of the things they're supposed to do is listen to live performances. So I'm going to cue her up when she's done eating. She's going to start performing. And theoretically, they should like... I'm going to pour a platter because I have a feeling nobody's going to actually make drinks. I was thinking about giving them money. Obviously, it's going to cost them money to serve drinks and stuff. And I think they should make an income from having this illegal <laughs> this oh here's one club member why don't you play cards okay no one's showing up this could end up being a disaster we had one club member show up down here everyone's probably hanging up out upstairs and it's gonna be very annoying did you get your food okay Ren you gotta get in your outfit course she's a classy classy lady with her little speakeasy outfit all right she's coming to start performing everyone better get down you okay i thought that was her coming this is Catherine's look actually that's her every day that's not her formal i don't think um Why was that so low on the menu? Is this really what I gave you? Oh, 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 we nakey. Girl's got abs though. Oh, oh. Aww. Open. She, she definitely doesn't have the Ren grandma look yet. Are you singing or are you just standing here? All right, you guys need to come watch. Uh oh. She's dizzy. I should have just done their everyday outfit. This is going to be really annoying. Girl, I'm glad you're actually making drinks, but get get dressed. <laughs> that was an oversight. I should have just done their everyday outfit. Look at her! Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, you need- Everyone's here, though. That's good. Look at them! They're all so pretty! Hey, where are you at? You're sleeping in the bath? When everyone's down here doing illegal activities? No one's watching her, though. No one's watching her or listening. Either or. Nobody's watching or listening to her sing. Oh, yeah. This is our most... Um, she really is embracing the flapper look here. Look at the badonk donk on her. I don't think she had a makeover, so, um. What the heck? You dressed in a Santa Claus? Um... I guess you can wear this one. Wait. Um. Is dancing on here? Yes. A lot of dancing too. All right, everyone, go go. Uh, they're just defaulting to drinking the alcohol. That's the number one thing they're doing <laughs> in the speakeasy tonight. 
let her blow. Nobody's listening to her <laughs> sing. Ren, Ren. Maybe we need to do jazz. Oh, are they listening? Oh. Oh dear. Oh boy. He, he was getting down. <laughs> he was getting down. There he goes again. Alright, I actually, while we're right here, where'd she go? She's still behind the bar. Can I start a pregnancy for you now? With your husband? Why is he not coming up as an option? I'm so confused. I keep trying to make her pregnant and he doesn't kid <laughs> child what are you doing go back upstairs and eat go get some food there's food everywhere he's like I'm out I'm I'm yeah the old man is ready for bed Ren's in bed everyone went to bed the youngins are the only ones partying. But it's busy. <laughs> She's embraced her bartender duties. She's killing it back there, man. She is... What do you guys think? Should she get a day job? Or do you think... She should job. I can't even hear her singing right now. Girl, what are you doing? Why do you have no voice? Oh my gosh, she just ripped a fart on stage. Now I can hear her. Can I not have the song? There's the vibes. There are the vibes. The dog's even here. The doggo's even here. Shun Yarba Chips. Kill. Spino? Yeah, fruit. Oh, I miss you. We miss you in the house. She's so pretty. Her and her sister look a lot more alike than I thought they did. Where'd she go? But man, I was in Cass and I'm like, Catherine is literally so stinking beautiful. It's crazy how beautiful that Sim is. Oh, Sam, you've joined us. <laughs> oh, he, he's taking his alcoholic beverage to bed. He's like, I'm done. It's over for me. Mildred as well. Mildred. It is a school night, isn't it? Yeah. So perhaps 2 a.m. Is last call for the speakeasy. I, I do miss having slice of life so that we could actually be drunk right now. She needs to steal something. Alright, everyone. Everyone, head to bed. Banter with your BFF. <laughs> I want to end the gathering, but I don't want her to leave yet. 
Ren just went to sleep. She's like, screw it. Forget that I have a gathering going on. I'm, I'm going to pass out. Do you have anything you can give her? A book? Seduction by the Sea? A romance book? Yes. Give that to her right now. I'm almost feeling like Leo might do a little seducing, you know, before marriage. I don't know. I get those vibes from him. Bavu. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <Yes>. Aww. <laughs> like, we've had zero drama in the family. I don't know. Huh? Yeah, he's the genius and everything, but I just... I feel like... Huh? Thoughtful message. Every day we share together, we're creating our own fairy tale. I look forward to our happily ever after. Oh, girl, you are down bad, aren't you? She's she's feeling him. Attempt to seduce her. 3 a.m. You might not have an A grade for much longer. When is your birthday, by the way? <gasps> no, I forgot. This is the, the one that's hiding. It's his birthday today. So this is his last day of school. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so in my not so berry, I don't know which mod it is, but like literally I can click here and do a woohoo like on any object. I wonder what mod that is. Are you telling me we got dust bunnies in our barn? What? Is she still a teen? Why haven't I unlocked the woohoo? Have we not kissed yet? No, I don't have. We've kissed. What? I don't have Wicked Whims in. That's what I don't get. Is it maybe I have RPO and I have That would probably be the only mod that I don't have in here. But I have that in the uh -huh. ultimate decades. I don't know what mod it is, but you can woohoo anywhere. So my not so berry sims, the the founders have a tradition of woohooing in the loo on the toilet. In public places. <laughs> but I don't have the option to even woohoo with her. Oh, because we have not had our first kiss. Well, that makes sense then. First kiss at 4 a.m. in the speakeasy on a school night. School morning. Where are you going, girl? He wants to kiss you. Why? Why are you? Why are you guys sitting down? We're supposed to be kissing. <sighs> We're. No, you're supposed to be kissing. Kiss. <laughs> I have wonderful whims in here too, but maybe it's a more updated version or something. I don't know. Do, do, do. Ooh, love is in the air. His fun is low, so I'm gonna see if they'll woohoo in the cow shed. Nope. How do I woohoo with this girl? Mm. <laughs> she probably doesn't want to. <laughs> He's disgusting. Oh, it hasn't registered the <laughs> first kiss yet? Uh-huh. Luna mm. Bissella. <laughs> Pondo. Two Gaba charms. <laughs> now that I'm thinking of it, though, I think the risky woohoo percent for teens is really high. Oh, Umber on. <laughs> Umber Grove and his wife getting it on right on the sofa. It must be RPO because I have 
wonderful whims in here right now. Ooh, so and I have... cool. Okay, there ain't no woohoo happening. Um, our man's is, um, yeah, going through some things right now. <laughs> I do. I got. I'm not gonna lie. I have had my share of interesting playthroughs with wicked whims. Um, I do like someone brought up basemental drugs for this for moonshine. So that's something I need to think about too. Um, but I tend to keep those things private things, you know. Well, he's going to school after not sleeping and hanging out in the speakeasy all night long. You didn't sleep much either. Girl, you can't afford this. Your grades are so bad. And I don't really know why. She has her skill. She's going to school. So I'm not entirely sure. She's going to go eat this that's been out all night. That's disgusting. So we have a birthday and I can't... I almost forgot about it because it wasn't actually on the calendar. In a way that actually stood out to me at least. Wow. Nobody slept. Um... So be the roaring 20s, I suppose. We're just going to party all night and never sleep. It is what it is. All right. Um, this poor guy. Well, I tried to at least get his fun up and let him have a woohoo. Night on the town. We're going to have a night at home at the speakeasy. You should be more than well rested, girl. Come sell your painting. You went to bed early. <laughs> it does not feel like it should be her birthday. But her birthday is in a day, right? That's crazy to me. Wow. All of our sims are not having a very good time at the moment. Alright, ladies. We gotta get it together. You know what I mean? Um, I know you were up all night, but let's roll. Well, actually, the two women were probably like, you know, as much as we're having a good time here at the speakeasy, we know that we have a lot of farm work to do in the morning, so we're going to bed early. <laughs> No woohoo before marriage. Yeah, maybe she shot him down. He did stink, too. So, no woohoo for them right now. She's just leaving. Maybe she was waiting. She's like, go take your bath. <laughs> go take a bath and smell a little bit better. <sighs> Ew. Ew. That's what she was saying about you last night. Did you even do anything to further help yourself? Of course you didn't. Why would you do that? Why would you? Feed the dog. Why are you stuck on your sister? What's your sister? She's napping. <laughs> this is going to be fun. No one's going to have very good grades. Aww. Look at this good bean. He cleaned up from the parents' night of craziness. Huh. Before school. He didn't even eat his brekkie. He just went and cleaned up for his parents. And his grandparents. Who just had to drink all night. This is where we're at now. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know. We gotta live it up because we got the Great Depression coming. That reminds me. Alright, so we have how many days of the speakeasy? We had one... That would be seven days to New Decade Eve, obviously. So how much money do we think that they would make at the speakeasy in seven days? Because I think we need to give them that money. But the Great Depression rules. Let me look again. I think we have to get rid of all our money. 
Um, <clears throat> so anyone who has a career must lose their job. Um, bills are only allowed to be paid once the electricity is shut off. Okay, so it's an optional. Okay, so it says added difficulty to simulate the stock market crash, reduce your total household funds by 40%. We'll probably do that. But if we're doing a percentage, then we need to make some money because we're like broke right now from building the speakeasy. But I'm like thinking they're, they're going to make some money with it. And I want to give them that money. Does that make sense? They're not going to be providing these drinks to people for free. And risking their livelihoods doing an illegal activity for free. You know what I mean? So I'm thinking we need to give them some moolah. Maybe $500 a night or something. That would be a lot at this time. But she's making over $1,000 painting right now. So... All right. <laughs> Ren is now single and loving it. She's got a new lifestyle. <gasps> no, 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 no. In fact, he's going to school. Don't die. You better make it to school. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh yeah, we could. No, just go to school before you die. Jeez. Yeah, we could use some kind of dice roll to figure that out. Maybe for each night and then add it up. I'll, I would just do it in a lump sum. I don't want to have to sit here and add money every night. I don't know how he's making it through this school day. <laughs> oh, man. All right, ladies. Are we doing anything worthwhile? No. She's already starting her drinking for the day. Um, she's... Uh, Spending our money at the speakeasy at 10.05 a.m. Leo just got the results. His scores aren't quite as high. Should he sign up to retake the test? Retake the test. He's a genius. Okay. It didn't do anything for us. Ren, are you washing clothes in dirty water again? Ugh. Girl, I'm ah. telling you what. Oh Someone needs to walk this dang dog. I don't know where he's he's make, making eggs and toast every day okay as soon as you finish eating you need to train horses like there's no way around it right now um that's just the way things are can you hurry up and eat your food what are you even doing thank you get rioni back on them jumps or ignore me okay you brought your food all the way out here that's perfect oh my kitty cat's trying to get out of the office you guys can't see it do you hear him oh here's his tail <laughs> do you need to go use the litter box see miss hey you're gonna break my doors down All right, get on your other horse. Hold on, I'm gonna let the cat out while he's getting his horse. Well, actually, I'm not. I'm gonna wait until I tell him to do the pull or the barrels first. Ooh. I'm coming, Seamus. I just don't trust the Sims. Okay. You know, honestly, <laughs> if you could just do this, I would have no problems making sure both of my horses are getting exercise and training every single day. 
But this isn't a thing. You can't just tell your horse, hey, go practice those jumps. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That just isn't a thing. If only. Oh, Lion, Strangerville is a possible world we could use. For foosh. For foosh. How are you still knocking barrels? Get it together. I've. Have I ever actually. Let's race these. I want to see. I don't know if I've ever actually seen that. Race them barrels. You do it at a trot? That's you racing the barrels? That was uh -huh. it? <laughs> yes. Can't. That can't be right. <laughs> oh, this horse is miserable. It's going to buck us off. There we go. I was going to say, ain't no way. Woo! Look at you go. Uh huh. He's killing it, though. He is definitely killing it lately. Um, I never can remember, though, what we need to have. Because we've been doing Western Pleasure somehow. That's the one we came... Oh, gosh. Yeah, we're not doing any competitions right now. All right. For the expert, we've been getting first place, right? We've gotten first place in the expert level. So he's one above what's recommended. Oh. Oh. So we're kind of in between right now. We got to get to nine, nine, and five. So we, that's right. I completely forgot. We need to work on temperament. That's actually the big one. Which is fine because right now she's stinky and miserable. So... All right. No, we're not actually entering. We can't enter. <laughs> you are not in any shape to be entering any competitions at the moment. You're going to work with your horse here. Get the temperament up a little bit. Okay. Our daughter's asleep. Why do I feel like she shouldn't be? She should not be asleep. Ren. Who is that? Whatever. Ren, you're going to have to repair this. You. You. Should be paying attention to what your child is doing. You know what I mean? Child should not be asleep. Child is stinky and disgusting and hungry. And thank goodness aging up soon. I want them to have another baby, you guys. But I don't really want to deal with another infant. If I'm being completely 100% real with you all. I'm not really feeling it. Girl. Girl, what are you wigging out about? I don't want a copyright strike. <laughs> are you getting it? Are you, are you struggling with that a little bit? Wait, 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 wait. She's still orange. Where is she? Hold on, Sam. The fun. The fun. Of course it's the fun. Why wouldn't it be the fun? We're cheating. Because I cannot get these horses to have fun. All right, Sam. Actually, he is, like, whooped right now. I'm just curious what would happen. I'm curious. So we're going to do it. We're going to see what would happen if we switch this to Rosie and we do a master. When Even though we're this far behind. It costs money. We're poor now. Hopefully we at least make some of it back. Yes, Leaf, there are, unfortunately, um, 
copyright strikes for the sims music like the ones that are like remakes of sure have arlene over your cousin aunt aunt not cousin aunt but like the songs that are like redone in simlish oh yeah they will copyright strike you so fast that's why i never re-uploaded our all day stream because it was like an eight hour stream and i'd edit out all of the music to be able to post it because we had a sim that we were doing like rags to riches and all he had was his earbuds that he got for free so he was always listening to music so there were so many parts of that that they told me i could not have and i just did not have the time or the wherewithal to edit it all so it never got posted after the live stream uh i want to be a ninja um sure he just wants to go to sleep and I made him go compete <laughs> wait were you cleaning the horse stalls how are they always clean weird alright Jojo did you have your friend over did not play so no now we're really broke okay we're not doing that again my bad, my bad, okay? I wanted to see what happened. Because we were getting gold medals when we didn't have the skills before. So, Ren, you know what this means, right? You know what this means. Get to work, girl. Get to work. Oh, look. We have a bear wall. Um, So, I did like the idea that was suggested in chat that we should roll to see what they make. Oh, she's angry for what they make at the speakeasy. So I might do that. Um, oh, girl. Oh, oh, is life not treating you well? Oh, boy. Because we need some money. Um, 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 do I have dice set up? Probably not. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 So, oh, look, it is. I just have to fix it. Hold on. Hold on. We don't want it to be that large and in our face. All right. What should we roll? I'm thinking like a D10. And it's like in hundreds of dollars. Oh, cool. We get $100 for the first night. That's perfect. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to have 410. Whoops. I always do that. I always forget to write the money part. All right. We'll see how we do tonight. Yeah, that's what I just did. See, we're, we're vibing on the same wavelength, Leaf. We're, we're there. We're on it together. Okay. Um, birthday. It's 6 p.m. Um, um, before we age up, is she... She's still a teen. I'm inviting her over really quickly. Yeah, you're right, Oberon. $100 is good for the first night until people really start hearing about it. Um, Thora, I need you... Yeah, she washed them in dirty water, so we're cheating it. Get over here. We're just full of cheating lately. <laughs> Dislikes dancing? Joseph! If you must, if you must... All right, hang those on the clothesline. All right, she's here. It's my birthday. You know what I want for my birthday? My fun to go up before I age up because this is tragic. Go, don't go do it in your mom's bed. Please don't do what I... Not only that, but you're going to kick him out? Okay. Yeah, alright. 
in mom's bed. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, who is that, Ren? Ren, that is a nice painting. It's not even done and it looks that good. Girl, what are you trying to cook? Go finish your painting. You can cook some dinner for us. Serve some... Um, I don't want to use my flour, though. Flour. Flour! Stop with the flour. Everything takes flour. <gasps> Potato and fish. Fish and chips. Sure. We have fish. That must be really nasty fish. Yep, in mom's bed is definitely rebellious teenager. <laughs> All right, I, I fear that there is no birthday cake. There is no birthday cake for you. All right, he had to get it in, no pun intended, before he ages up. Because she's probably going to be a couple days behind him. I reset her, actually. She aged up too soon. Um, and I could just change her again, but you know, it's fine. And you know, he could actually leave, like, immediately. Upon aging up. And I. I don't know. Either we do that or. Or we. Go through the whole. Proposing to her and stuff. With him still here thing. He loves the outdoors. He's a genius. And we randomize everything. And we only veto if it makes like. Zero sense. So ambitious i see it i do okay um genius he was a renaissance sim right honors woo, woo. smart boy <laughs> meanwhile his sister's about to flunk out all right. So we were going to send him to university. Um, um, we don't have the money <laughs> at the moment, but maybe we could have him apply and then we could just send him to university. Arlene and Thora have a difficult dynamic. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Apply to universities. Oh, wrong sim. <laughs> I suppose we should do scholarships, huh? Um. Um. I don't think he's skilled in athletics. We definitely have moderate household funds right now. You know, it's not great at the moment. Yeah, I think he would live in dorms. I don't think we'll go there with him or anything because I don't feel like remodeling. Joseph lost his tooth. Um, He's had no teeth for a while. <laughs> now he really has no teeth. Lexu, Lexu, sheep. Ooh, I dig that vibe, but I don't want to get copyright strikes over it. Brutally dance? He hates dancing. Oh, it's metal. <laughs> Turn off! No, we're just going to change the volume. Who's screaming? What? Is it? Kim New, Olga. What are you doing in the bathroom? Rolshba. Yeah. Yeah. Rolshba. Alapaz. 
Are you practicing acting right now? Is that what you're doing? Hmm. Hebani Yikla Shippy Oragaba. Harfin Quacks. Boncha Shinoi. Okay. Oh. Well, whatever she's practicing, she's feeling very strongly about it. Did anyone even eat this food? Not really. Grab some. What are you doing? Come eat some food. Eat some food. You're almost sorted out. You're close to being sorted now. All right. So with Leo about to move out, I think we can wake Miss Girl up. They can do a risky woohoo. We only let them woohoo like once every couple years. <laughs> Cause I don't want babies. Oh. So we really should probably have one more. Mildred is going through some things. Listen guys, we are falling short on the speakeasy thing right now. It's 10 p.m. and we ain't even made it down to the speakeasy. <laughs> All right. Um, he's not going to be able to hack it tonight. Um, so I think the elders, the elder group will start a gathering. And I would like to see Little Miss Wren actually not go to bed this time. <laughs> you know what I mean? Make a drink. Make your favorite. Come down here and then we'll change your fit. You come here and dance. Oh boy, y'all. I might have to sort these dogs out. I don't... <sighs> Husbands, let me tell you what. I told him he had to take care of them while I was streaming. Have a sim stay in the fine emotion for 48 straight hours? We've done that, really? Right now, Jojo is our heir. Um, So, officially, per the rules, we can have female heirs now, Leaf. But I think we would only do that if we have no other choice. Because then you run into issues of losing the family name and all of that. So... Joseph, for right now, you can't see him, <laughs> but he is it. He is the next gen. And of course, this is his sister. So we have two generations living in this house right now. Um, the tot is here vibing to metal. Um, why are you? What? What? Did I not tell her to go to the speakeasy? Ren, did I start the wrong club? No, I didn't. Because, no, 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 no. Get over here. Oops, I hit the wrong thing, though. Come make yourself a glass of wine. You come here and dance. Where's the rest of our group? What are you doing? Yeah, you better get over here to the speakeasy right now. She's here in her PJs. <laughs> Tonight's kind of a bust, but we're not going to go to bed without having a couple drinks with friends. Okay. The oldies are here tonight, so we're in our pajamas. <laughs> it's, oh, it's the golden night for the golden... Um, I don't think I count you as... An oldie, but here you are anyway, huh? How are you doing, kid? Tell her she looks very nice today. So, overnight. We so, miss you. Okay. How have you been? Have you been good? Why aren't you pregnant yet? <laughs> and why can I never get her? Pregnant with MC Command Center. Pregnancy start. Oh, it is Irvin. 
Okay, so we're going to randomize it. She's not pregnant herself yet. Oh, it's doing it automatically. Okay, that makes more sense. I was like bugging out thinking it wasn't letting me choose him. And it was just going to be a random person. So we're going to leave it blank for random. One male baby. She's been married for years now, so it is time. It is indeed time for that to happen. And I normally would not speed it along like that because every two days is a year in this challenge. We have to, you know, nudge, nudge a little bit in that direction. How are we all doing in our PJs? Hey, Ernest, what's up? This is Rin's dead son, Ernest. Died in the war. What you making? Are you still making your... You better not still be making your wine. Because that's very sad if that's what you're doing right now. Oh my god! Sam! <laughs> Don't come into the speakeasy like that. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> this is too funny. <sighs> These guys are just vibing. We're just vibing. Irvin's always over here dancing. All right, we've been cutting it off at 2 a.m. This has been a very lame night without the youngins around. How are we doing on our needs, actually? Not too bad. However, it has taken Ren the whole entire evening to make this drink. She literally has done nothing else. Yeah, fruit. Is she still on practice? Please tell me she's not. She is. Oh my gosh. No, Ren. <laughs> well, that makes a heck of a lot of sense, doesn't it? Oopsie. <laughs> All right. She's just really got to pee. Oh, he took her drink. Well, well, well then. All right. You go pee, old lady. The, the youngest of us no. have this. Ooh, it looked like she had a hickey, but she's just sick. Why don't you check on your wife? Oh, they're flirting. Check on her and make sure she's okay. She's sick. Oh, why are you heartbroken, ma'am? What is going on with you? Alright, we're gonna need the young kids to pull something more fun out of the hat for tomorrow night's speakeasy. Because <laughs> these guys, I don't know. I don't know. Alright, it's 3 a.m., Let's roll to see what we get for the day. Let's see. Eight hundred dollars. Woo woo! Eight hundred simoleons. Going in our pocket. Um. Burm, 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 burm. Ten seventy. Nice. All right. I gotta ensure that everyone's actually sleeping. Why are you not sleeping? Bro. Are, are you kidding? Like, he's actually joking, right? Like, I didn't have him attend because this is how he was looking. Oh, these Sims. All right. These guys are smart. They're doing the correct thing. All right. She's got to eat first. No. Just in case. She might be pregnant. You never know. Oh, it's getting toasty in here with the door open. 
or closed <laughs> the door closed oh my gosh <laughs> i never have the door actually closed because it does it bakes in here and it's literally just the computers running like it's a very small room you can't really tell it looks much bigger but it's quite a small room and literally the computers make it hot in here it's no joke it heats up so fast All right, you need to go to bed. They're listening to Sims music again. That's a throwback. We should be okay if they listen to that particular channel. You know what? It just occurred to me that might have been what you meant earlier when you mentioned the Sims music. Like the actual Sims music. I wasn't think My brain didn't go there. Alright. Are these like about to spoil? Yes, of course. Alright. Are you rested? No. Are you, are you going to bed now? Go. Girlfriend has to pay. Alright. Pee and then go back to sleep. Another tooth! He just lost two. What is this pile of laundry? Oh my goodness, why are you up? Oh. Let's just stand here for half the day when we really have to pee and we haven't slept. I guess he has nothing better to do than sleep. He's got to wait for his university application. Okay, you can eat this, dear. It's your birthday, right? Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Girl, I hate to do this to you, but look, you gotta do your homework. Whoa, there's some money I didn't realize we had. All right, actually, could probably sell most of this. I think we need to plant some strawberries, right? She needs to plant stuff. She wants to plant stuff anyhow. And I think the strawberries all tried to die on us. Flowers. Only 200. Oh. I'm sure we have plenty of all of this in our fridge, but whatever. It's fine. But these, I think I'm going to have her check. Yeah. We have one strawberry bush, so come replant the ones that died. Wait. Wait. We had that many strawberry bushes? Oh, well, whatever. It's fine. We'll have even more. Oh, we could harvest all these and get some money. We need some money. We need some money. What else is new? Um, well, okay. Well, here's partially why we have no money. She just keeps putting all of these in her inventory. Okay, go sell that. And then you're going to finish the ones that are not finished. We'll sell this beautiful one, even though I kind of would like to keep that one. Resume. This one's painted. Oh, goodness. Jojo, honey. I hope you don't have any plans of being a musician. <laughs> Alright, on that note, I think we're going to take literally just two minutes for me to go blow my nose because this happens to me every time I stream and I don't know why. Um, and then I'll probably let some dogs back in here so we have dogs on doggo cam. Um, and then we'll be right back. I just literally need just two minutes and then we'll come back to whatever's happening here and we'll have a birthday. Sounds good to me. Hope it sounds good to you. BRB.
that wasn't even two minutes, but we've returned. Um, the dogs are not here yet, but the door is open. <laughs> they will arrive. <clears throat> All right. This madness. Oh, goodness. Oh, and I can feel the cooler air. It just gets so stuffy in here. Are these dry and warm? Nice. Oh, wait. Did we paint Mildred yet? Did we? We did not. We got to paint Mildred. Why do I feel like we did? I keep trying to do this also. <laughs> Take a screenshot of it. But I think we do need to paint her. Um, so maybe... Maybe we will... Pause on this one. Put it back in the inventory. We will grab our pose. Statue. And we'll try to find decent pose in this mess. Um... Um, there do be so many, so many, um, um, Mildred, what vibe am I getting from Mildred? A little smirk. Let's see what this one's all about. Okay. She looks so much like Lily. Oh my gosh. Let's get her into her speakeasy outfit. Yeah. Hey, story girl. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good weekend. Oh, yes. Slay queen. Okay. Now we're going to paint from reference and we're doing mediums, right? <laughs> It is her last child. Should she try painting the children too? Or should we just start doing photographs and making them black and white? Because we can do f pictures now. If we want. But she's still alive and she's the painter. So we could keep painting until she dies. Maybe someone should take a picture of her. Yeah, Sepia, that's right. She is sultry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, I think. I'm not even going to say it in case I'm wrong. Um. Yes, this is functional, right? Yes. This is a functional one. I think we need to get a picture of Ren. For sure. Which direction here? Um, we didn't even finish the treehouse either. I say we, okay? Yeah, I know. It's me. It's, it's a me problem. <laughs> Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll let her paint that and then try to get a picture of her, maybe? We have to have a picture of the beautiful... We don't have a picture of her husband because he's gone. But, all right. Leo, can you please fill that again? Thank you for checking in about my horse story, girl. I know you're watching it back, so you're hearing the story now. There's not much of a story to tell at the moment. 
Oh, sweet. You have water on you right now. Are you really still out here working on this? Okay. Jojo's currently trying to drive me crazy with the violin. We're getting our last child's... Oh, oh, I can unpose you now. I'm so sorry. She really wants to steal something. She's feeling absolutely bored out of her skull right now. Um, she currently does not have a love interest at all. I don't even know if she knows any teens. Do you know anyone? You know Maya? And a bunch of chickens. <laughs> okay, so we have the toddler's birthday. And then we can probably go with her really quickly to meet some of the other teens in town that we don't currently know. Um, he desperately needs to take care of his horses, though. Sam can't join the sewing circle, Lily. Don't be silly. No boys allowed in the sewing circle. Where's your other horse? They both are miserable. What else is new? Seriously. Joseph, are you going to be a creative boy? I don't even know who he is as a person. Seriously. Creativity is level 5 right now. And social is 4. So he's creative and social. And he's outgoing. So that makes sense. Are you going to follow in your grandma's footsteps? Maybe he'll get into photography? Did you finish it? Girl, you are so awesome. I'm curious, okay? This one's worth over... Girl, would you quit doing that? I was gonna grab that painting. Oh my gosh. Where is it? Killing me. We gotta rearrange. Um... gonna be a little off kilter until we get another painting or picture um could go boys and then girls down here there we go look at our beautiful Aww, beautiful kids. That is so true, Story Girl. Story Girl on YouTube made a good point that for Ren, it's not about like necessarily breaking the rules. She just likes the finer things in life. Remember, she's a snob and she's materialistic. So that actually makes so much sense. Like, and she's also very artsy, obviously. She's creative. So having the speakeasy is like an outlet for all of those things. Especially if we keep having singers and performances and things like that going on in the speakeasy. I actually, I was driving home earlier. And I was thinking that she could potentially try to sell her paintings too. During speakeasy time. But I don't know if that's necessary. She's just going at it on her own over here again. Um, you are about to pee your pants. All right, she's peeing. Um, we have stuff to sell again. So that's perfect, actually. You know what? We're just gonna sell it all. We're gonna, we're gonna sell it all. Because I think we have enough stuff, you know, in the fridge. I think we're good. She's still ill. Like, she's not been feeling very well. 
Oh my gosh, Sam, can you repair this? Why is everything like always broken broken? Do you have the stuff where you could do sturdy faucets on this? And no. Alright, Joe, I can't handle it anymore, dude. I honestly cannot take it. Father Winter, why would you do this to me and give them a violin? Why? Why? Um, Leo, can you please? Moana? <laughs> can you guys hear him now? It took me a minute to try to fix that issue, so hopefully you can hear those uh, sounds now. Thank you, Oberon, for the save reminder, because I have not saved the whole time, have I? I don't think I've done it once this whole time. Man, you know what? I would be in some trouble without y'all. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot our casket's still out here. <laughs> so if you missed it, Ren went through a midlife crisis and she wanted to sleep in a coffin. So I was saying that she was getting a casket to like test out her her future resting place. And it's still in the yard. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, we need... Rosie, let me guess. Your fun is tragic. Your social is also low. Get out here. For one thing, bro, seriously, we have to get this temperament up. It, it's... Don't go to sleep, Rosie. Rosie? Rosie? <sighs> Ooh, a game crash when you're in the middle of saving is not a good time. We could sell all these buckles for money, you know. We have three first place westerns. We have a bunch on the wall in the house already. 1,000. Yeah, we won't sell the master horse one when we get that one. But we're going to sell some of those because they're just stacking up. All right, so apparently we can't take care of her horse until she wakes up unless I make her wake up. So let's do little ones bead B day. Oh my lord. Um Do we feel like there's like a case of neglect going on here? <laughs> Okay, all right. Are you growling in your sleep? Because there ain't nothing there for you to growl out, buddy. So glad you could join us, Tonks. Whoa, sorry guys, taking you for a ride. All right, your other horse is asleep, so you might as well, because this one's going to have to take over eventually. Come fiddle with this one. They're totally miserable. Wait, she woke up! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on, his it is not full. You are lying so hard right now, game. Mm -mm -mm. Well, it looks like Joseph wants to be a creative sim, so it's a kind of start thinking about where he's gonna go in life. Temperament is not budging very well. Does this actually do anything like these options? <laughs> Compliment temperament. Does that work? Hey, no. What are you doing? Are you really going to run all the way over here? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's doing his horse stuff. Let's just get this poor child. 
Girl, where? why are you running all over the whole universe? Oh, my. All right. Well, you know what? We don't even do birthday parties anymore. We never have the time, the energy. I literally almost clicked teen. <laughs> All right. So Ella is turning into a child today. So this is exciting. She can finally start taking better care of herself because she's very much a forgotten child. Um, most unfortunately. <laughs> Charles has sent her a gift and Max has sent her a gift from beyond the grave. How sweet. All right. Randomizing. Another genius? I guess. So let's do mental. Yibs. Yibs. How are you? Oh, girl, you look. You look like Ella. All right. It is time. It is time for Cass. You guys, I should have ran to the bathroom really quickly when I took that very brief break. <laughs> now I have to go. Oh, the lawnmowers are coming out around the neighborhood. I don't even think it's that warm today. People, people do be going crazy when the sun comes out. Because I literally don't even know if it's 50 degrees today. 40? No. Okay. Feels like 45, but it's actually 50 degrees Fahrenheit. So the wind chill must be pretty bad because it feels like 45. But people are getting out. Oh my gosh, look at her. You're wearing that one skin, aren't you? You are. It works though. It does a lot for their lips. Do, 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 do. Um, where's the blush? Okay, that could work for her. These very rarely fit any Sims. There's too much happening. They're they're too strong. But if she's going to be extra blushy, let's just see. What does this one look like? See, those are so much better. The freckles do be freckling in this family. Which freckles are you currently wearing? Where, where, where? Those aren't too, too bad. All right, let's get you in your proper outfit. Oh, I didn't give you lashes. We cannot move on without. All right, you're going to have to wear these ones. Um, What about these bad boys? There we go. And your hair. I don't mind it. Wow, that is long. Holy cow. Um... Wow, I never had a chance to use that one. That one's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm actually not mad at this very simplistic one she aged up with. Now, I did download some, I thought. Yes, I did. I did. <gasps> Cute! Oh my gosh. Mm. Uh, 
That's so adorable. Um. I don't know why I'm feeling blue for her. Where's just the blue one? I saw a blue one. Where? There it is. Do kind of love that mm. blue for her with that, that hair color. To the city? We could consider doing something like that, Dragon. How are you today? Are you doing good? We could... So, Leo's gonna go to college. Uh, but he's not the heir, obviously. But in the future, we could <laughs> consider something like that. I mean, we're going into the 1930s soon. Someone could venture away from the farm. Um... Let's see what happens. Like, I want to know. Okay. I want to know who our Jojo is as a person before I really decide what his future looks like. Mm. Um, how hard is it just to get a pair of, like, stockings for you? These are not going to be the right color, and it's going to anger me. Uh. She's cute. Alright. Um. So right now, our heir is, like, seeming like he wants to be kind of another creative sim he's into playing the violin very badly mind you but he really enjoys playing the violin um so i don't know <clears throat> if he wanted more opportunities for music than moving to the city would be a thing, you know? So we should... S we'll just see what happens. Let's just say I'm not opposed to it. I'm not opposed to... Moving on. Into the cité. Although that would entail probably having to do a lot of... Hmm. Like, work to the world, perhaps. I, if you guys had to guess, what year do you think, or what decade do you think I'm looking forward to the most? Curious what you think I'm really looking forward to. Mm. We're not that far from it, mm. but we're not like super close to it either. Athletic wear, I don't know. I do near. Oh, look at this cute skirt. Coot, coot. <laughs> cute skirt. Uh huh. Oh boy. I don't know if I'm gonna make it without running to the bathroom really quick, you guys. Fifties or sixties? Yes, the sixties. Number one, like, I grew up with my father, who is, like, I mean, dead ass, like a hippie. Like, my dad. Um, but also, the Sims resource has the best collection of 60s stuff that I am so excited to get to use, because I've never gotten to use it yet. Mm -hmm. They did a whole Sims... Sims... I can't say it! S-I-M-X-T-I-E-S. The, the lips, the tongue, the mouth won't won't get that, that out. It just won't come. <laughs> so that is what I'm looking forward to. I love that era just in general. Sim 60s, is that it? There's a, uh, If there is an I there, that helps. Hmm. 
So Lion's watching it back right now, you guys, over on YouTube, and just said, I'm at the point where Ella ages up. I'll, f I'll bet she'll be adorable. And look, I mean, yes, there is no denying. Girl is cute. Her little athletic wear. Why am I blanking on what trait she just got? Oh yeah, genius. It's kind of... A, mm. Like, another one. <clears throat> okay, I don't want, like, flat-out tennis shoes. Something like that, maybe, for her? Alright, sleep. Sleep, 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 sleep. I think we can get away with these now. Not these ones, though. I guess pink's the only color. Um... Go with the oversized t-shirt. And we'll do some... No, 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 no. Here we go. Comfortable girl. Give us a little variety. <laughs> Words aren't wording. It's okay. Words never word for me. Let's be real. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and it's funny because most of the time, like, when I pronounce something wrong, which is a lot, it's correct in my head and it just doesn't come out correct. It's just a part of my personality at this point. You can just expect that I'm going to pronounce something wrong. Or fumble my words and say something really silly. <laughs> oh my god, my husband is texting me. Running to Home Depot. Okay! <laughs> You should buy me a plant. I don't know if he heard me. I'm going to text him. Mm -hmm. Like, I need more plants. <laughs> he got me a pot earlier. And I have plenty of plants. Like, I have... So there's two in here. Well, three. So these guys. This is my aloe. These are the babies that I just took out like a couple days ago. She had this many babies. There's five in here. So I just stuck them all in here to kind of grow on their own for a minute. So I have three plants in this room, but in my living room, I have like 30 plants, but he got me a new pot. It's an owl and it's so cute and pretty, but I don't actually have a baby to put in it right now. So maybe he'll buy me a plant. I don't know. I don't need any more plants. <laughs> But he did. He did buy me a pot today. He brought me home a pot. Like the good guy that he is. Because he knows I like owls. And it's an owl pot. <laughs> oh, man. I love the enthusiasm for the jewelry, but no can do, my love. Although we could start having more variety. Like, we need a sim with glasses. We haven't had that in a while. Maybe we'll give her glasses. Um, hot weather. This could be a problem. This is short-sleeved. Where's that cute little skirt? Now, the problem is, do we have a shirt for this? Besides this. I don't think other shirts are going to work. No, they're not. Um. Hi, Krylin. Is it? Ugh, my text is so small. I think that's an L. Krylin? And Michelle, I found you on YouTube with Ultimate Decades Challenge. Thank you. I'm so glad you made it into a live stream. I'm sorry that you missed them so much. 
you guys, I really need to fix my text from being like, so there's no, I use stream elements. There's no like zoom function. I go to view and there's like nothing there, but it's so hard to read this sometimes. Welcome in you all. I'm so glad to see some new faces here. We did do our death rolls for the ultimate decades challenge. Hey, this is kind of cool. This is kind of full of personality here. I, why do I feel like maybe this is her? For hot weather wear? I don't know. I like that. Ooh, the dark one. We're getting risky now. We're doing some... <laughs> some interesting things. I don't know that she would be allowed to show quite that much... Um, leg. Though. Um... Do-do-do-do! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's gonna wear stockings in hot weather? Hmm. Um, my children in the 1920s, okay? Hmm. There, that's too much blue. There's, there's, there's a lot of blue happening here. I need to do some serious catch up with your decades. Oh, yeah, you're still early. Yeah, so the good news, I suppose, for you is that I've been very slow on the uploads lately. Granted, there has been a lot happening, um, mm -hmm. big events and things that require a lot of management. But on top of that, yeah, I'm just behind in general. Um, so if you start catching up now, you might get caught up soon. Um, I do think once I get this next episode out, which is actually the, the like, after the Black Plague kind of, like, mini episode to, like, wrap up the year, because we did the Death Rolls live. Um, I think after that, I'm hoping and I'm going to be aiming to actually do, like, mm. two uploads a week again. Um... Because it's so much easier if you just go in and play and film it. When you have all this other stuff going on and you're doing the roles and all that editing stuff makes it take so much longer. But if you're just playing through, like that is so... And I have not been able to just play through for a while because I've done some story episodes and stuff. So yeah, I think I'm hoping it's really going to pick up more after this is in the rear of your mirror. This plague thing. Because basically, I broke that up into, like, three different things that we've been doing. We did the live stream. I did, a, like, a prologue story for it. And then this is going to be, like, wrapping it up. So mm -hmm. I'm I'm hoping after this is done and I can just play again. And I'm hoping my game's going to run better. Because there was that issue as well. My game was almost unplayable for a while. So, Yeah. Long story short, I want to get more uploads up more frequently. Nothing is satisfying me here, I have to say. Maybe we'll just do... Um, go back to the flats. Maybe we'll do black. And we'll go back here and we'll get rid of these and we'll do... Um, just some leggings like that. All right. Um, oh my gosh. Stop. Oh my gosh. You guys, she is everything. Oh, I love her. I love her so much. I'm gonna cry. Um, we do need some kind of boot for the winter. You know what I mean, girl? You don't want to be traipsing around without boots. 
Do 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 do. But yeah, this is our right now. We're in the 1920s. Um, but this challenge, sorry guys, this challenge started in 1890. So Taco, <clears throat> of course, he went to Home Depot and left the doors open so that the dogs can bark at the cemetery all day. Taco. So I live right in front of a cemetery, okay? And obviously there's people around in the cemetery all the time. Um, but when they see cars drive in the cemetery, they think it's like cars arriving to our house. So like when cars pull in the front, like when cars are in the cemetery, it's no different to them than it is when cars are in the front. So yeah, Taco, get away from the door. Just come here. Come here. Good boy, come. <clears throat> come on. Go lay down. Now I have every single one of them in here. <laughs> are these the ones you were talking about, Michelle? Because those are the ones I ended up grabbing. Maybe if I change the color of this, I'll be more satisfied. Since it has so much red in it. No. But I think that's her. Actually, let's just quickly change her hair for her. So she has a little variation when she's in her... Oh. Oh, that's why... I was like, why have I never used that? Because I don't have the mesh. That's why. Um. So she has short-ish... Short-ish straight hair. Do we have a short-ish updo? Short-ish up to? Hmm. Mm-mm. 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 I think these are all too long. So many broken ones. Like, she doesn't have enough hair for that. Something like that wouldn't be awful. Oh my gosh. Well, I might be taking my pee pee break so I can get these dogs under control. I just have to go close the door. That's all I have to do. I have to close the door so they can't see the cemetery. That's literally it. <laughs> Well, I'm not satisfied once again. Where is just a small... Okay, that would work if it wasn't shaved. Like a smaller ponytail of some kind. Like, it can't be that hard to get what I want here. Like, this is great, but look it! Her hair's not that long. Alright, we'll use our imaginations, I guess. And give her one of these. But what was the color she had? This isn't the color she started with, is it? It was more red. It was this one. It's the more red one. There she is. We spent far more time than we should have on this. I don't know what's going on with the hairline, but listen. We're ignoring it, okay? We're ignoring it. <laughs> But I think I'm going to literally take another two minutes. I took a two minute break and I should have went to the bathroom when I took that initial break. But I thought I was going to be fine. But it turns out I'm not fine. I really have to pee. So I'm going to go close that door, run to the bathroom. It'll be two, maybe three minutes, depending. Um, and then we'll come right back and we're going to take Mildred to meet the boys in town. So that's the plan. Give me just two minutes. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. BRB once again.
All right. I think we are all sorted now. Nova tried to psych me out. Acting like she had to go to the bathroom. She runs out the door and she grabs her ball. And I'm like, no, 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 no. <laughs> We're not playing ball. I'm on stream right now. I thought you had to pee or something, but no. No, 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 no. All right. So our girl's doing laundry right now. Is that in clean water? It does look like clean water. Well, now you're messing with my plans. Can I ask a question? Why can you not resume laundry? Like, that's so silly. Who's here? A neighbor. You are not a teen, though. So, quite frankly, I'm not interested in you being here, okay? Um, no. Are you going to stop doing the laundry on your own? Because you're starving. Oh, last exceptions! My children are always stinky, Lion. Always. That is their permanent state of being. <laughs> oh my gosh, everything's broken. So what do you guys think? Should we finally get rid of the outhouse? Maybe make it a gardening shed or something? Look at this. Look at this. It's destroyed. I think it might be time to say goodbye to the outhouse. Do they even really use it anymore? I don't think so. We have enough money, too, where we could probably upgrade the one bathroom that we still have, like, a shower that uses a bucket. Um, and let's put a light out here. I think it's time. We can make this into something else. We'll figure out a use for it. So we have this bathroom that we did a stream or two ago. That's pretty nice and more updated. This one, the sink and stuff is good, but we still have this shower. So I think we can finally put in something else for the shower. Um, what space do we have? Really no space to speak of with the door where it's at. So. Mm, I'm not gonna be satisfied with any of this, am I? It's not surprising. Maybe just go with this guy. So we had this one before, so it's a little bit better as far as stats. Um. Let me just go this route. I really hate that this window can't be centered. That stresses me out. We're slowly getting everything updated in this house. What? What do you mean? Um, whoa, that's massive. Mm. Hate, hate, hate. Uh, there's a severe lack of curtains for this window size. Mm. Go and get angry. We're gonna get angry now. These are also long. Why are you the way you are, game?
Why is this one tripping out so bad? And I can't... It, it won't... Like, if I go... I go like that... <sighs> what the heck? <laughs> oh my god, quit moving farther away from me. Okay, that makes me happier. Is there no light in here though? I don't think there is. My distraction level is insane today, isn't it? It truly is. Ella in blue from now on, you think? Yeah, blue's probably her color. She looks really good in it. Um, I guess we just wait for her to finish this stupid laundry. And then we can take her to meet everyone. Or I cancel it and we cheat it. I'm, I'm more for that right now. Oh, wait. It says it's pristine already. Nice. Okay, quickly go put that in the clothesline. What are you doing right now? Look at this mess. What in the world? Girl, are you that bad at laundry? Like, what have you done here? Look at this. What? She's really hungry? Um. But it's fine, I guess. Whoa, no. What What sim do I need? This one. The starving one. The tired one. Because why not take her out when she's starving and tired? There's really only one place we need to go. Well, is Maddox or... Yeah, I think it's Maddox is still a teen. Is Maddox still a teen? Let's stop here and see. I don't know. Oh, yes, Michelle. Sorry, I missed your message. So, in this challenge, I think you could start having... Is it in the 1910s they allow you to start having, like, indoor plumbing? And even some, elect like... Maybe not electricity, but maybe it was, like, oil lamps or something. I don't know. Um, but we took it much slower. We just started giving them indoor plumbing and stuff. Pause. What age are you? You are a teen. All right, let's see what we think of you. Should we try a funny introduction? I, I feel like she's not very funny. <laughs> Dude's got some major blush on. Look, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. And Kath. Burn has pulled through. Yes, grab that. Eat that. All right. Did you introduce yourself to him? What? Girl, what's wrong with you? Listen to me. You can eat your food, but introduce yourself to the boy, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He caught... He caught the toddler sickness. He was doing toddler interactions or animations or whatever you want to say. <laughs> oh, we're skipping prom. Prom doesn't work for us ever. Um, let's see what he's all about. And let's see what she thinks of him. Unattractive. Perfect. 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 Yeah, and speaking of the 60s and stuff like that, I think with the way we're trending, they're going to be really fun. This family is going to be really, really neat to play through some of those those decades. I think they're always going to be kind of the rebellious family. You know, probably hippies. That's the vibes I'm getting, you know what I mean? Anti-war, all that fun stuff. Especially, you know, looking back and seeing that we lost so many important people in our lives to war and that kind of thing. Like, yeah. No, you're traveling by yourself. Why am I even looking? You don't like him, so this is not looking good for us. If we're being real right now, I think there's only one teen... No, there might be two teen boys here. 
They're brothers, though. So here's where I might need to start putting in The Sims. Um, if she doesn't vibe with anyone, then I need to try to get that done before our next stream. Add more Sims to the world and whatnot. So we have more options as our children age and try to leave the nest and find love and families of their own. We need more Sims. This loading screen is taking a lot longer than normal. And I'm kind of stressing out. Although I think this happened last time we went to this lot. And it's probably because it's a full lot. There's a lot of Sims here. My loading screens normally don't take this long. There we go. There we go. All right. All right. We have Reginald and Thomas. I think this is a young adult. No. <gasps> That's her. She aged into a teen. Wow. The double nose piercing. Oh, and the clown blush. And the clipping rings in her eyeballs. It's beautiful. All right. So this is our only current potential love interest for our next generation heir, Joseph. So she just aged into a teen. He's still got like seven-ish days. This game did her dirty. <laughs> well, sometimes I allow this stuff to kind of help me determine like what kind of sim they're going to be. Um, so she's going to have some personality. Let's just put it that way. Our girl's tired. So let's just see what she thinks of these boys and then get our butts home. And maybe make a bestie here as well, perhaps. All right. Oh. Uh, Gabba. <laughs> Hey, y'all. Loving those pants. Ah, nope, sir. <laughs> Suli, Suli. Suli, Suli. Ah. Moochie, peachy, you nabby, flamon, sushi. That was enthusiastic. Goodness. All right, Reginald. Basic looking. Oh, boy. Maybe you like girls? No. Annoying and weird impressions. That's... That's great. Silly. All right. Can Thomas pull it off? I'm guessing not, but no. Okay, girl. What do you like? <laughs> a blonde. Maybe tall, dark, and handsome, and these guys just aren't cutting it. That's a bummer. Who the heck is this? Oh, the twins aged up too? This is a big family, man. There's a lot of Sims here. Yeah, I think the twins age. Oh, wow. The clipping dress. Oh, boy. Okay, that did not go great. So, next stream, I will make sure we have more Sims in the world. Um, <laughs> no love interests for her. Do we think Leo's... Oh, no. There's a fire. Oh. Are you guys... Oh, okay. All right. Perfect. All right, good. <laughs> oh, goodness, this game. Oh. Ten PM. She didn't do half bad, but the fact that um oh wait, there might be one more maybe one more teen in the world, unless he aged up. I thought Joe knew him. Maybe we never introduced ourselves. There might be one more option in the world, um, but I'm not worried about it right now. It was worth a shot to see if she liked anybody currently around. And she does not. Um, we could try looking at her preferences. So she only likes males currently. I would like to see 
some variety when it comes to that because we've not had well <laughs> i can't really say we haven't had that there has been miss Catherine making moves on ren since day one asking her on probably 12 dates at this point um but no real diversity when it comes to sexuality and stuff so um hair green brown green and brown she doesn't dislike it i'm gonna take the green off because let's be real we don't have that happening currently in our lives so no tall dark and handsome and no blonde um Interesting. Length, bald or short? That might be part of the problem because everyone's really got a lot of hair happening, you know? And straight or curly. Okay. Interesting to know. I took the green off because that's just silly, but are you going to make it to the bathroom? Because that's a long way to go. <laughs> are you... <laughs> Gonna be all right. Not one Weston girl liking everybody she meets and the other liking none of them. This family never an in-between. That's right. They're like always on the extreme ends of the spectrum. Oh, our sweet baby doesn't have a bed. Guess what? This bed's open. Let's let Leo take this one now. Um, and everyone else could be over here. Over here. It is 1030. You're not really tired, but guess what? Go to sleep. Um, You can take this bed now. I might even change the color of it for you. I shall be... I shall be kind. I shall be kind and get rid of the green for you. Oh. I wish we had more variety. Because we gotta change the color of the wood, too. So silly. Honestly, ridiculous. Um, sure. Um, bum 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 bum. Go to sleep. I know we got a last exception, and it might have been her trying to go to bed. I don't know. Ella and Thor are jokesters. Sure. I'm guessing Thora's not pregnant. We can still take a pregnancy test. Let's do that really quick. Leo, this is your new room. Okay, dog. I have enough of that in my real life. Please. Not preggers. I'm fine with that. They really like to vibe to the Sims music, you guys. That's like their favorite, I think. No one's tired because I left the lot, but we're putting them all to bed. Night night. Bye. Um, I don't think we have much happening. Not much. Okay, um, we have a remembrance date. We're probably not going to get there in today's stream. Um, what time is it? 4.42 now. So we're approaching the three hour mark on the stream. I'm, as always, hungry. <laughs> is it a shock to anyone? I had some Cheetos before stream. Or cheese puff things. Again, I do eat. I swear I eat. It's just on stream days, I would normally eat, like, when I start stream. So it's hard for me to eat a proper, like, lunch on stream days. I just find it, I don't know. It's really hard for me. Unless I grab something on my way home. Which I try to avoid doing, because, as you know, <laughs> fast food, especially here in America, it's not good for you. Um, so, yeah. Probably not going to stream too much longer because I need to eat. And I need to cook.
We made out at Aldi yesterday. Made out, like, money-wise. <laughs> we didn't make out at Aldi. <laughs> um, $70. And we got so much fresh fruit and fresh veggies. We have fresh green beans and fresh carrots for dinner tonight. I can't go to any other store and get what I got yesterday for under, like, $125. And I spent... I could not believe... When I saw that total on the register, I was expecting it to be at least over $100. They had some good fresh fruit. Everything was under like three bucks. So long story short, I'm having lots of good fresh vegetables for dinner tonight. It's going to be delicious. Um, okay. What do we have to accomplish before we... How many days to the next decade, actually? We have like five days. All right, we'll play through Sunday. Maybe we'll do something. We need to see if his university stuff is back yet. Oh, wow. We need to do inventory clean out, too. Holy crow. Ugh, why do they always have so much food? Probably gonna break the sink doing that. Maybe we'll take him to see his girlfriend. So he can let her know, you know, he applied to colleges. He's gonna be going away to study and kind of get a sense of her ideas as to their future. I don't think he's gonna propose or anything right away if he's going to college. Um... But maybe we'll pack a picnic or something and they can have a little date before he goes to a college. Who's here? What you doing? Oh, is that so? Okay. Okay. We should probably send um, Sam off to a competition so he can redeem himself as well. Because <laughs> I did a, do a dumb thing and sent him to do a master competition when he was not ready and he did not place at his last show. So he's probably feeling demoralized. <clears throat> Janet Wright was adopted. She looks cute. There's a cute bean. All right. It's almost 3 a.m. Are we going to wakey wakey? We can't fast forward because daddy O's here. Ren has the single and loving it lifestyle. I wonder if woohooing with her ghost husband would mess with that at all. I feel bad that she's so lonely and she never gets any love in her life. Although I don't even let my married couple get love more than once every couple years, so. Which, like I said, we can start implementing birth control and stuff now. Even just general calendar planning of the cycle, you know? All right, you're up, so guess what that means? You are on breakfast duty. <clears throat> um, let's do a fruit salad. Where are you? What are you haunting? Wait, I thought I bought them a different fridge. Did we decide not to do that? I remember looking at fridges. Hmm. Maybe I'm shanking a shot out. Ren, good morning. Jump, jump. You got up just in time to not have to make breakfast. Woo woo. Do you want to go for a walk with the dog, or why don't you go on a jog with the dog? Jog with the dog. Jog with the dog. You need something to occupy your days, my love. Oops. 
Yeah, someone's gotta do laundry again, too. Oh my god. Does it ever end? Honestly. What does he even like? He's miserable all the time. Does he like anything? Fitness. That's the only thing my Sims like. He likes deception. Uh-huh. I remember that now. Fitness, huh? Well, we do have this, so why don't you go practice punching for a little bit? Um, you need a shower, and you haven't even hardly rested yet. Tisk, tisk. Everyone's digging into Brecky already. Jojo, do you want to play with your friends, maybe? We forgot about you again this stream. I'm so sorry. <laughs> There's too much going on all the time. It's hard to pay attention to all of them. Look at his cute little gap teeth. Look at it. Saba Pufa. <laughs> Ooh, it's summer. Did I do I remember us talking about there being a swimming spot around here somewhere? Where actually is that? Can't even click on that. I thought someone said you could swim around here somewhere. You like deception too? Crazy. Yeah, I don't think you can swim in any of this. Is there a pond? You can, can you swim in that pond? Where's that pond? Why do I always forget where that pond is? Oh, rooster, stop. Wait. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I don't think you can swim here either. They need activities. They have to do more with their lives than just hanging out on the ranch. <laughs> And we have had some suggestions. Oh no, someone broke the sink. About maybe venturing away from the ranch a little bit. Get some variety in our lives. Leo's gonna be the first to kind of get out in society um, again. Ren, why don't you do this? Leo, why don't you see if you got your... Um, see what's in the mail. I don't know how to do this without a computer. Oh, yes. <laughs> hey, we got seeds. Those can go. Um, okay. Was that a gift? No university. How many days is that going to take? Wasn't that like two days ago? Run still out with a dog. Aw, you're petting the horsey. No one else has really gotten into the horses at all since Sam. I said we were going to have Mildred help, and then I never did that. Do you want to get into the horses a little bit? Because we could use a little help with them. Especially getting Rosie's temperament up. Why don't you do some stuff with the horse? Oh, she can't. That's right. I forgot. Kids can't. Stupid. <laughs> I don't know if this actually does anything. But we'll have our chit chat with the horse a little bit. Make her contribution. This kid's always doing the dishes and throwing stuff away. <laughs> like, all the time. Okay, when you're done with that, can you clean the shed and refuel the feed? And you have taken over somehow with the milking and stuff. But I don't think she ever lets him milk her because I've never found milk in his inventory. You can't even interact with this horse. Oh, 
She can't do like anything. That's so irritating. Hygiene is low. Well, I can't brush you, which is the stupidest thing I've ever heard in my life. But. Alright, Sam. What are you doing? Sam. Did you put laundry in the dirty water again? Bro, leave that to people who know what they're doing. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, Rony Pony did die. Um, Rony Pony was really old. Rony Pony came with us in 1890. So, Rony Pony was pretty much overdue to die. Unfortunately, it was very sad. It was during the last stream. All the streams are available to watch back. Um, I was trying to edit them, but I've only gotten one done. And I don't think that's happening right now. Um, so they are all very long, which sucks. And I've been meaning to kind of talk about that with all of you. Because unfortunately, these really long streams that people go back and watch actually really hurt my channel. Because YouTube does everything based on, like, someone clicking on a video and then watching it all the way through. And if someone doesn't watch it all the way through, YouTube, like, sees that as a negative thing. So when you have a three, three and a half hour video, people aren't going to sit down and watch that all at one time normally, right? So those videos do a lot of damage to my channel. But I do leave them up because I know not everyone can be here. And if I had the time <laughs> to actually edit them all down... I could just do those as edits and that would be better for my channel health that way and the analytics and everything. It's all math, you know? Yeah, unfortunately, it just makes it look like no one's interested in my videos <laughs> just because they're super long. That's all it is. And YouTube's not really smart enough to know it was a past live stream kind of thing. That's why typically people don't make videos that are over an hour long on YouTube. Just because the way that they do all of their measuring. And then if they see stuff like that, then they don't push your videos out to people as much. Because they think people aren't as interested in them. So it's a whole thing. Um, but I, I, some, some people who live stream to YouTube will have a separate channel to post the full live stream on and I thought about doing that but that means I'd have to have a second channel yep lion you're still a little bit behind we did do that actually we made sure she did not have she had green lions a little bit behind and said we need to make sure she's not attracted to rainbow hair well she was <laughs> indeed she was I don't know. I felt like I was going to have Leo go see his girl. Uh-oh. Now you have the, the scratchy illness. Oh, you can't go see your girl now. Oh, man. But he doesn't even have his university thing back yet. So. I feel like that that's not really pertinent right now. You're painting again. Now I have to go through here again. And find your finished ones again. Killing me, Ren. Ren, what do we what do we think? Um. Yeah, that's right, Michelle. A three-hour stream. Like I can cut them down if you. Cut them down to, like, the main content. They can sometimes even be under an hour. Um, it's just a time issue. I do all the stuff myself. I edit. I do all my thumbnails. Everything myself. It's a tremendous amount of work. Um, but I probably do need to try to get all those edited down. <laughs> oh, I can't even imagine it right now. crazy she wants to evolve some plants but i actually haven't i haven't had any that need evolved in a long time kind of weird 
Oh, who's calling you? Oh, your your dead dad. Let me join the speakeasy. Sure. My dead father, why not? <laughs> why not? <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> um, okay, so maybe instead of taking him, maybe we'll just I was thinking we could do a picnic and we could take everyone out. But I'm thinking maybe. Oh, thank you so much, Michelle, for the tier one sub. I very much appreciate your support. I would like to see Lily because we got her pregnant earlier in the stream. So she might even be kind of closer. She really shouldn't be at the speakeasy drinking either. Hi, Patch. Welcome in. How are you? Do you know if viewers have to stay into the absolute last minute? Um, so what they do is they look at it basically like how much out of the hole did the person watch? So the more someone watches, the better that is. Um, but like if someone stops and goes back later, like that's going to be counted, I think, as a whole new person, even though it's not. I don't know. It's 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 a lot. Um, and I don't care about that so much. Honestly, obviously, because I've left them up. Um, but just as a note, I, I am thinking of ways that I might be able to get around that being a problem for me. Whether that be a second channel or making the long form private. But I have a lot of people that go back and watch, and I know that. I'm aware of that. So I, I don't want to make the long forms private unless I'm posting them elsewhere, you know? I don't know. Wow. Dang, girl. You're killing it. Sell that. Alright, let's see. I want to see... So let's start an early speakeasy. Hopefully she doesn't drink, because she is pregnant. But we need to hang out at the speakeasy one more time before the stream's over. So let's start a gathering here. Oh, no! We just started a gathering! The appropriate music is playing down here. Love that for us. Why not? Let's get the youngins go. It's Sunday. Let's get the youngins going too. And Charles is now. <laughs> Charles is now part of it. <laughs> yeah, Dragon, that's true. Yeah. And they change the algorithm all the time. Like, it's hard to keep up with what is good or bad for a channel because they do change things so much but like to simplify it for myself i kind of look at the bigger picture like my ultimate decades videos they have the best like retainment people typically watch them through um so it evens itself out i guess is what i'm getting at i i feel like oh wow Oh, dang. Wow, that's some perfect music. Alright, you... Does this girl even look pregnant? Barely. Where are you at now in your pregnancy? Second trimester. So next stream, we'll get to meet Lily's Bean. Look at her. Cute. I wish I didn't have to change all of their outfits. It's kind of a, it's a kind of a lot. I don't care about the boys. If you're gonna perform, definitely need to change. So if you're just tuning in, this is our decades challenge that we started in 1890, and we're currently in the 1920s. This is the Weston family. They're living through prohibition right now, but they decided that they did not agree with that and they created their own little speakeasy to illegally drink and entertain themselves with family and friends and they're grooving. What can I say? 
That's true, Dragon. Live streams should not be treated the same, but they are. And that's why it, it unfortunately harms the metrics. Um, I need someone to quickly just do me a solid here and sweep the floor. <laughs> Please. <laughs> um, where is... Um, okay, she's coming to sweep the floor. Where... Oh, you're peeing? Okay, I will allow it. We need a... We actually need a bathroom down here. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> Sims on the dance floor when introverts wild out. No kidding. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is she even singing? Honey, no. No, no, no. Sing a legit song. Girl, seriously. Please. There we go. That's the speakeasy. Yes, that's the speakeasy vibe. Girl, what are you wearing? Who are you coming in my speakeasy looking like that for, huh? Oh, I have regrets. I shouldn't have done them as formal outfits. Now, if we were doing events, that would be different. But we're not. We're doing clubs. Yes, she is grooving. Holy cow. Okay, she's improved since our first speakeasy night. Except she pauses a lot. <laughs> she wants to watch the people dancing. Once again, everyone's ignoring her performing. Uh, slow dance please work please work where's your wife on this list oh wrong sim i, I thought i was on sam no i was not on sam come on please do what i ask this is the most beautiful woman ever I did not delete. I deleted everything in it, unfortunately. The outhouse. But we could put in, like, the actual little... If, the, if that's what you're talking about. We had, like, the actual little outhouse before. So they're not gonna listen to me. I wanted them to slow dance. Why does this never work? Is it because there's other sims on the floor? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, come on, game. Why do you do this to me? So annoying. I wanted them to dance together. <laughs> Meh. Great so reputation. Hard, Everyone loves attending social events that Sam hosts. No kidding. They love his speakeasy and his illegal alcohols. Of course. Of course. Like, I imagine they have, like, a super secretive code word to get into the speakeasy. I don't know what that code word would be. But, yeah. Let me try from his POV. Can we get a slow dance? Please? No, why are they ignoring me? All right, get over here right now. You come here. Where are you? Are you even around? Get down here right now. If I don't get you guys to slow dance, I'm going to be... I'm going to be angry. Girl, are you coming here? Sam, don't you leave. Get back here right now. Right now. Do the dang... It won't even come up. Do the dang slow dance. Shelby, you. Apparently you can't slow dance when other sims are dancing, which is so annoying. Stupid. Stupid sims things. Oh, I love the vibes of this jazz. Ren's just over here like, oh yeah, chugga chugga chugga. <laughs> Let's quickly roll to see how much money we're going to make from this one.
So if you're just joining, we decided they're going to make a little bit of money on the speakeasy, but I didn't, we were kind of just chit chatting about it and I didn't really have a plan. So we decided together that we're going to roll a D10 and times it by a hundred every night to figure out what they get. So last time we got 800 simoleons for the night. Tonight, only getting better. 900 simoleons for the evening. Wow, you all are killing it. Please tell me you're not practicing right now. You are. Why? Drink something. Enjoy your dang self. Now, last time I thought that was my fault because I accidentally told her to practice and then I was upset with myself. But I think because we have the mix bar drinks thing, they're defaulting to that. So, yeah. All right. Maybe I'll just take that off and see if she stops mixing drinks. Like, you can drink whatever you want. Don't just stand there and practice all night. Um, 900. Wow, how do we have that? We've, like, made bank in this live stream with the gardening. And I think we even have more now to sell. We do. Holy crap. Okay. Well, if we have to get rid of 40% of our... Household funds for the Great Depression in a few days. I think we're going to be okay. Um, girl does, is angry. She does not like your dancing, Irvin. Oh, she really does not enjoy what you have on offer here. She thinks she can do it better, but I don't know. Did you just punch yourself? Leo, where's your lady? I suppose we should check. Oh, she's right in front of my face. I mean, they technically messed around a few days ago. So she could be. She could be preggers. I don't know. They messed around in their his parents' bed. <laughs> Oh, her neck. Perfect. <laughs> Should we just check and make sure she's not? Just in case, you know. She's not. Okay, good. You're going away to college. No more woohoos with her. Oh. Okay. Oh, Vadish. Deep thoughts. Uh -huh. Go ahead and tell her you're going to college. Like you're anticipating you're going to be accepted. You graduated with honors. The biggest yeah. issue is money. Oh, but you've been helping the fam save up. And she's like, I'm out. It's fine. You're leaving me. It is what it is. This room's very hard to keep the walls up. I'm discovering. Will you guys maybe slow dance? Here. Here, here, here. Let's get rid of her. And see if you will even attempt it. Please, somebody do a dang slow dance. Come on, bring the romance. What are y'all doing? Panduli. Ah! Uh. Excuse me, B. It's not your dance floor. How rude she is. Are you kidding? Can I help you, ma'am? Yeah, you already tried to trick me once. You made me think you had to potty and you just wanted to play ball. Which I don't blame you. We'll go play ball after stream's done. Yeah, we will. I promise. The sunshine's shining. Um, we'll play ball. So nobody will slow dance. Really getting me angry. But someone has to feed the dog. Because the dog is apparently starving. Oh, look at this. Everyone's up here dancing instead of in the speakeasy. Everyone is just vibing here. 
Okay, can you pause the vibe and feed the dog? Why am I clicking on the laundry? Everyone's maxing out their dancing, so that's fun. <laughs> this is not where we're supposed to be partying, you guys! Look at the, look at the pregnant lady. Getting down with that pregnant ballet. She's got some boobs now. Got some boobs with that pregnancy. Oh my gosh, you guys should see this dog. She's got her face squished into my lap so hard. But you lied to me. I know you don't have to actually go potty. Because you already tricked me one time. Indeed you did. She's probably thinking, but I successfully tricked you, though. <laughs> Did someone feed the dog for me? All right, good. Okay. Well, it's 10 p.m. on Sunday, y'all. Um, we've been at it over three hours today already. That that went by very fast for me, I have to say. Um, I think I'm going to call it so I can go work on the Ultimate Decades episode. Let me save because I've only saved one time or so this whole stream. But if I want to spend some time editing and stuff and have time for dinner, then I probably should go. And I really want to get that episode out ASAP. Um, it's been a lot of work, but I think y'all are really going to like it. I hope you enjoy what I have done for the... I'm not going to lie, I was crying, okay? I was crying editing it. Um, so it's sad, but... <laughs> like in a... I don't know. It's, yes, it's bad, but you already know where we're at. You already know which Sims died, aside from the ones that I'm pleading for. So it's not like that's going to be sad or shocking at all. It's just what I'm doing with it. It's kind of emotional. It was for me anyway when I was editing it. So I want to finish that up sometime this weekend, hopefully, fingers crossed, um, and try to get it posted ASAP for you all. So I think we're going to call it a day let me quickly um look here <clears throat> but i hope you all had a fun time with me today it was it's been kind of nice not having a lot i mean yes we've had birthdays and stuff but it's been more low-key lately and that's that's been nice for me anyway i'm trying to see who's currently playing sims for for us over on twitch but the problem that i always run into is i don't know some of these people and i'm fear for what i'm sending you to you know what i mean um so let's say goodbye to youtube thank you all so much for being here where's my screen that i need this one I appreciate you all so very much and I hope that I will see you again soon. Remember, I, I do have to once again cancel the midweek stream because I have to work that day so that I can have Tuesday off for my vet appointment. So we will come back again with this on Saturday and then hopefully around that time, I'm hoping we'll get back to our regular Wednesday, Saturday schedule. So thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate you very much. I'm saying goodbye to YouTube. Twitch, if you will hang around just a moment, we will go find someone's raid. Bye, YouTube.